What up YouTube, it's your boy Sabio, back at again with another reaction video. Today we are going to be reacting to a highly requested video on my channel called Pentakill Mortal Reminder. I do have a little bit of background on this, kind of. I know that this is a band made specifically for Riot games, for League songs and soundtracks and whatever. Kind of like True Damage with the, the Giants video that I watched. So we're gonna be reacting to this today, see what exactly is going on here, reacting to the video, react to the music, seeing what we got for us. League has blown my mind every time. Like every time I've reacted to one of their videos from their cinematic little, whatever they're called, their the little season premiere videos to music videos to just like the straight up like character background videos that I've done. They've all been great. They've all been different and the music has been different in all of them. But I'm interested to see like where this goes with a name like Pentakill, pretty intense. And the thumbnail has a red haired chick with like some chains or something. Pretty intense. She reminds me of Kushina from Naruto, Naruto's mom. She kind of gives me Kushina vibes with the, the red hair and the chains with like the little spears on the end. So I'm actually super hyped to see where this goes. They're gonna be sealing some demon foxes and some babies. That was a horrible idea, by the way. You guys are horrible parents, but we love you anyway. Let's get into this reaction though. Okay, the background music's starting to pick up, so before we, before whatever's about to happen happens. These guys are really cute. These little rabbit people, their world, town, kind of looks kind of like, I don't know, like a Facebook Farmville type game. It's it's cute. So how does, how does the Kushina character fit into this? I'm gonna play it, figure out, but I'm just, I'm curious. I have no idea where that guy came from. Probably from the, the, the big dark cloud. Um, yes. 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 That, that, that double bass already, already with the super distorted guitar. Mmm. Mmm. Hits you, hits you right here. Right here in your soul, bruh. Run. So is that is that guy zombie buff dude? Is he supposed to be Slash? Is is that is that what's happening here, dude? If they they had Slash work on this song, bruh, oh. Oh my god, my inner music nerd is drooling right now. That would be iconic. But yeah, he uh he he hit old boy with the fireball. Um so GG little rabbit people cuz y'all y'all about to get wrecked. This is not looking good for you. Plus a little floaty guy who looks like um Ebony Maw from Thanos's group in the Avengers. Yeah, he's he real creepy. So um Run. Same. Same, bruh. He was over here trying to get his swerve on with the little rabbit girl. They're like all types of different colors. Now they're like blue and didn't... Was she purple? Like what? Whatever. But yeah, as soon as she showed up, yeah, he was like, psych, and she like fell off the table. But yeah, yeah, the, the red hair and chains. Mm. Yeah, she like, like, 
I don't know. I don't, I don't know what the word I'm looking for is. Um, what's the opposite of, of evaporating? Apparating? Is, is that a word? Is, I feel like that's a word. My brain pulled that from somewhere. But basically, she just came out of that dusty old piano, which... Not... Not sure how that works. Um, but, okay. Uh, I don't really care. She's hot and um, edgy, so I'm, I'm here for it. The other two, are, are they... They don't seem to be battling, so I'm... I'm interested how this is going to work. But you have one guy singing, the other guy, the slash looking zombie guy playing the guitar. And she just came out of the piano, so I'm assuming she's gonna be playing the keys, which means there might be a key section coming up here in the song, which would be legit. So far, it's really, really heavy uh, drums, as well as super distorted guitar and very heavy attitude raspy gargly type vocals uh gives me like you know 70s 80s ozzy vibes i dig it oh okay uh yikes the drummer oh my god the drummer Jesus Christ, the the drum fills in between the singer's lines are insane, like insane. I, I need to know who that drummer is because this person is a beast. I don't know if this is all one band, like this is an actual band that they hired to make this song, or if these are just... Uh, an assortment of different studio musicians. If you don't know what a studio musician is, basically it's a bunch of professional musicians who are hired by studios to play backing tracks, to play instrumentation on different songs. Studio musicians often perform like in the studio, the actual thing that you see the band perform on stage because, <laughs> I mean, to, to call a spade a spade, a lot of times studio musicians are way, way better than your average, you know, garage band guitarist, drummer, bassist. These are musicians who have been playing for 30 years in the industry and playing an assortment of different music because if you're a studio musician, you can come in one day and you're playing, you know, backup in a jazz band and the next day you're playing behind Justin Timberlake and the next day you're playing this and melting my brain out through my ears. So yeah, we're back, back, back to the video. That's a big boy. Also, where are they coming from? Like one dude came out the ground, another dude came from the cloud, but the chick came out the piano somehow and he like ripped through the wall. Was he summoned? Is that is that what that was? Because it looked like the singer was flipping through a grimoire. I, whatever. I don't care. It's cool. That dude's huge. Also, side note, I love the fact that he's so big and has so much mass that when he walks, the little rabbit people just like bounce around, <laughs> bounce around him. Are they gonna fight? Is he the is he the new singer? Were those his screams? Because he seemed it seemed like he was doing those screams, but it sounds like. The previous singer, and also when he was beating on the the, the mountain with his uh, what are those warhammers? Are those maces? It, it went in line with the drum fill, uh, and who 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 me likey. Now, Sam.
Okay, um, I take it back. The way that guy was holding that, I say the guy, the zombie dude with the, the, the top hat. The way he was holding that, it made it look like it was a bass, not an electric guitar. So, probably not Slash, sad bass, teardrop. But the big dude seems to be the guitarist, which, um, why didn't you introduce him first if the guitar section is introduced immediately in the song, even before the vocals? Why did, why is he the fourth person who was summoned and not the first person who summoned? Also, I don't know why, but like in my head, I associate bassist with being big they have big hands big arms they're just big dudes typically so why isn't the big dude the bassist instead of the guitarist that's i'm nitpicking here but like these these are things i want to know so if you know the answer let me know if not let's go bars <laughs> All right, all right, guessing game time. There's like some 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 Valkyrie looking person flying in with like the big metal wings. Kind of looks like um, Archangel from X Men. If if I got any X Men fans out there, yeah. <laughs> anyway, um, what what instrument do I think that person's gonna play? We have drummer, bassist, guitarist, singer, keys. What what could this person be playing? Maybe maybe the big dude's the lead guitarist and that like angel person, Valkyrie person is going to be rhythm guitarist, but I feel like they should have introduced that person earlier, but then again, they should have introduced the guitarist immediately when that crazy riff came in. I don't know. I don't know what to guess that person is. I'm going to assume they're another guitarist, but you you never know. This this band could be like Slipknot and have twenty seven members. That sounds that sounds like guitar solo. We're definitely gonna go back for that. Um, this this Kushina chick. Uh, it looks like she's performing like Magical Blast when she's playing her pterodactyl looking keyboard. Um, what is that? What is her power? What does she do? Cause it kind of looks like she's doing. Earlier it looked like she was doing like a an attack type magic. She did like some blast at the the guy who's trying to hand her flowers. But now it kind of looks like she's doing support magic on. Um, Big Daddy. <laughs> um, so, what exactly is her ability, and how does it relate to BDSM? I mean, her chains. Yeah, yeah. Ex explain this to me. This guy, his guitar looks like an axe. I get it. That that makes sense to me. The the guy with the the freaking lumberjack beard. He has muscles. He's beating on things with hammers. I get that. It, explain to me what she does. <laughs> <laughs> GG Okay, before something else happens, so, 
I was kind of right with the Valkyrie thing because that looked like a chick. Actually, kind of looked like she had the same haircut. Um, but she landed with a sword, which I'm not against, but that's that didn't seem like an instrument. So why is she here in, in this video where everyone else has instruments? These are the questions I have. These are the questions I would like answered. That was sick. That was super sick. And they wrecked that town, dude. Like, Jesus. And some, one of the little furball dudes got punted. Oh, this seems fine. <laughs> well, there you go. I'm not gonna say too much here at the end, other than that video was awesome, that song was awesome, I'm definitely going to have to check out more of that band stuff, and yeah, that's, that, that, that's, that's my favorite video so far. Video, song, well, maybe not video, song, definitely, yeah. Boom, we finally got something to beat out the Giants song, that, that was great. I appreciate you guys recommending that. Way, way better than the last two things you guys recommended to me to make me try to, to die in a puddle of my own tears. So, I appreciate it. In the meantime, you guys have a fantastic day. Definitely make sure to like, comment, and subscribe. Share the video with all your friends who like League, who don't like League, who just wanna see some black guy scream at a camera about animated characters. Alrighty guys, we'll see you on the next video.